welcome to the Mind Muscle Spirit YouTube channel. My name is Judy and today I'm going to go through a leg and core workout with you. It's going to be approximately 30 minutes long. I highly recommend that you do about a 15 minute cardiovascular warm up beforehand to warm up your muscles, get your heart rate up. With your muscles being warm, you're going to be better able to go through all the different movements we have. So you can do something like an outdoor run, power walk or jump rope. Warmed up, we're going to go into some dynamic stretches and we're going to start with some windmills. So we're going to reach up tall, we're going to go round to the right, down, brushing your fingertips against the floor and up. We're going to do three total to the right, three, two, one, reach up tall. Now we're gonna go three the other way. Three, two, and one. Awesome. Okay, next we're gonna go into some inchworms. So you're gonna make sure you're standing in a position so that you've got plenty of space in front of you to walk out on your hands, okay? So we're gonna reach up tall. Bend forward, bring your fingertips down to the ground and walk out on your hands. Hold the plank position for three seconds. Two, one, then walk your feet forward towards your hands. Hold the stretch, push your heels down, hold. Then walk back into the plank, hold for three, two, one. Then we're gonna walk the feet forward again. Hold the stretch, feel it in your hamstrings, push your heels down, walk back, and hold for three, two, one. One more time, walk the feet forward, a little more this time, push the heels down, hold, walk back into the plank, hold for three, two, one. Bring your knees down, relax, bring your butt to your heels, stretch out, and we're gonna go back into that plank position. This time we're going to go into a Spider-Man lunge. So you're going to bring your right leg, right foot to the outside of the right hand, rotate, look up to the ceiling, bring that hand down to the inside of the right leg, right leg back, left leg forwards, left hand up, rotate, look up to the ceiling, left hand down, left foot back, right foot forwards, right hand up, twist. Open up the hips, right hand down, right foot back. Left foot forwards, left hand up, rotate, look up to the ceiling. Bring that hand down and left leg back and hold the plank. Three, two, one. Good, knees down, butt to your heels. Push your hands into the floor. And you're gonna come up to your feet. And now we're gonna open up the hip joints, okay? So we're gonna do some leg swings. So we're gonna start going front to back, nice and high, 15 swings. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more swings. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides. One, two, Three, four, five, six, higher, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more swings, nice and high. Four, three, two, one. Awesome. Now we're going to go sideways. Okay, so you're going to go across the body and out to the side ten times. Three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Switch sides across the body, out to the side. Two, three, four, five. Nice and high. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Good job. Okay, so now we're going to go into the resistance part of the workout, starting with single leg glute bridges. Plank with leg lifts and side plank dips. We're going to do two rounds of that, okay? So get your mats ready. I'm going to start off lying down on your back. Okay, so you're going to be lying on your back, knees bent, and you're going to cross one foot over the opposite knee, raise both hips, 
squeeze the glue as you lift, bring it down, almost touching the mat, but not quite. Up and squeeze. 15 on the first side, three. Up and squeeze, tight. Five, we've got 10 more. Up as high as you can get, squeeze tight. Squeeze. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two, one, and switch sides. Cross over the other foot, bring the hips up high, squeeze tight, keep your hips level, abs tight. Squeeze tight. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more on that side. Four, three, two, and hips up, one more time, awesome. Okay, plank and leg lift next. It's gonna be on your elbows and feet. Body in a nice straight line, taps tight. You're gonna raise one leg and bring it up as high as you can, squeezing that glute 10 times. Two, squeeze, keep your abs tight. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten, now switch sides, ten. Squeeze that glute. Eight, back straight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome. Okay, side plank dips. Okay, side plank dips, ready, and up. Hold at the top, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Awesome. Now the same thing on the other side. Five plank dips. Legs straight. Elbow directly below the shoulder. Up you get. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Awesome. Okay, we're going to start over. So lying on your back. Okay, so lying on your back. We're going to go into round two. Cross one foot over the opposite knee. And ready, get to put the hips, hips up. Keep your hips level and up. Tight squeeze. One. Squeeze, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five, four, three, two, one more. Beautiful. Switch sides. Fifteen. Up and squeeze. Tight. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Five more. Squeeze tight. Four, three, two, and one. Beautiful. Okay, back into the plank. Front plank. Elbows and feet. Hold the plank position. Abs tight. Back flat. Raise the working leg. Squeeze the butt. Two, three. Keep that leg straight. Four. Squeeze. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. Other side. Up, squeeze tight the glute. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Well done. Okay. Last time for side plank dips. On your sides, legs straight. Elbow directly below your shoulder, forearm out 90 degrees. Ready, you're gonna lift up, hold at the top, hips almost down to the mat, and up. One, two, three, just 10, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice job, other side, 10 on the other side. Leg straight. Ready, and up. One, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more. Beautiful, okay. Stay on the mat for the next three exercises, which is gonna be a knee to elbow crunch, reverse crunch, and side plank and leg lift, okay? So staying down here, starting off on your back, knees to elbow crunch. So you're gonna have your fingertips behind the base of your head, supporting your head and neck. Opposite and elbow means opposite knee, other leg extends out. 20 reps. Two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, lying back. Both feet up in the air. Knees straight. You're going to lower the heels. And all the way up. Bring the hips up off the ground. Ten reps. Hips up. Two. Keep your lower back pushed into the mat. Three, four, abs tight, lower back down. Five, five more reps. Here we go, up, good. Four, hips up. Three, two, one more. Awesome, okay, this one's a little challenging. <coughs> so you're gonna be holding a side plank. You're gonna bring your body up and you're gonna raise the top leg up and down 10 times. If you're challenging with that, we can do knees, the same thing. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine. One more. Up. Beautiful. Okay, other side. I'll do the full one this time. So you've got your option. You can be on the one knee or both feet. Up. Ready? One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Three more. And up. One more time. Up and down. Nice job. Catch your breath. Okay, we're gonna go back to the beginning. Back on your back. Get ready. Okay, supporting your head and neck with your fingertips. Opposite elbow means opposite knee, other leg out straight. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10 more, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Excellent, okay, now the reverse crunches. So lower back pushed into the mat, abs engaged, feet up in the air, knees straight, hands down by your sides. Lower the heels as far as you can and hips up off the ground. 10 reps, two, three. Just lower your heels as low as you feel comfortable with. Don't go too low, it's gonna strain your back. Just go as low as you can. As you get stronger over time, you can do more. That's it, last two reps. Hips up. Hips up, one more for luck. Awesome. Okay, side plank with leg lift. This is to activate and get the mind-muscle connection with the glute medius. Ready, body line up. Remember, you can use your knees if you want to. Leg up, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. Down, nice one. Okay, switch sides. Okay, elbow below shoulder, 90 degrees at the elbow. Up, lift. One, two, three, four, five, 
five more, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Okay, next we're gonna be on our feet with a resistance band. You can use the fabric ones or the rubber ones, either or. We're gonna stand up, place them on above the knees. All right, you got your mat ready above the knees. Okay, so we're gonna start with banded monster steps, then we're gonna go into glute kickback, and then we're gonna do squat jumps, okay? So get into the good posture, so your feet are gonna be just about far enough to have tension in the band and the glutes activated. You're gonna sit down on your heels, push your heels into the ground. Okay, let me squat down, booty out, chest up. That's your position. And then you're gonna step back, in diagonal, you're gonna sink down into it as you land your heel on the ground. Four, stay nice and low and sink into it. Good, chest up, booty out, seven, eight, nine. Stretch out that band, 10 more. 10, nine, eight, seven, good. Six, five, four, Three, two more. Stretch the band, stretch the band. Good. Glute kick back next. Let's go have something you can lean up against the surface. So you're gonna have one leg remaining on the ground, stabilizing. The other leg is gonna work. You're gonna squeeze the glutes, kicking back, and slightly out, so really squeeze. Bring it leg forwards, a little bit more in front of the ground leg. Kick back as far as you can, arcing the foot up. Got that arc. Good. 10 more on this side. 10, 15 total. Nine, eight, fall back. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Awesome, other side. So get the ground foot stabilized. Raise the working foot, kick back, hold and squeeze. Forwards, back, hold and squeeze. Really stretching the band, squeezing the glutes. Back from 10 now. Good, 10, nine, squeeze. Hold your abs tight, upper body stable. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, squeeze. One more, squeeze. Okay, so we've got this Squat jump next. You're gonna jump out wide, squat. You're gonna jump in, squat in the middle. 20 reps. Ready for deep breath and go. One, two, three, four, five. 20 total deep squat. Awesome. Keep a good pace. Squat in the middle and out wide. 10 more. 10, nine, eight. Stretch the band. Five, four, three, two, one. Good job, okay. Little rest, I'm gonna go back to the start. Let the heart rate come down a little bit. We're gonna go back into the monster steps first. Are you ready? Okay, so stretch out the band, activate the glutes, keep the knees out in line with your ankles. So remember, you're gonna step back in diagonal, so into position, booty out, lower back arched, chest up, shoulders back. Ready, here we go. And sink into it on that landing. Two, three, four, five, six. Sink into it. Keep it going. We got halfway. Back to nine, eight, seven, keep those knees out. Five, four, three, stretch the band. One more time. Awesome, glute kickbacks. Ready, rounded leg, raise the working leg. Bring the knee forward and arc up. Squeeze the glute, stretch the band. Two, slightly out to the side. Four, five, Back to 10 now, 10, nine, 
Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Okay, now the other side, same thing. Grounded leg, raise the working leg, foot off the floor, knee forwards, arc up, squeeze the glute, stretch the band. Two, squeeze, four, five, six, seven, eight, squeeze, last five, four, feel the glutes working, three, two, solid, one, beautiful, okay, deep breath, ready for the squat jump, three, two, one, go, one, two, deep squat, three, four, keep going, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, halfway, keep it going, nine, eight, come on, deep squat, don't be shy, six, five, four, three, two, one more, amazing, okay, take a rest, one more round. Whew. Take a drink of water if you need it. We've got about 20 seconds left to rest. Get ready, shake it off. The heart rate come down. Are you using your heart rate monitor? Okay, last five seconds. I'm gonna start one more time with the monster steps. Ready? Into position. And steps, sink into it. One, two, Great job. Three, stretch the band. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten more. Keep going. Come on, stretch. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Plant the heel. Three, two, one, awesome, okay, glute kick backs. Hold on to your surface, round the, work, round the foot, lift the working leg, knee forwards, up, squeeze, stretch the band, four, five, we'll go back from 10, nine, eight, seven, squeeze, five, four, three, two, one, nice job. Other side, ground the grounded foot, lift the working leg, knee forwards and back. Arc, squeeze, stretch the band. Four, five, upper body still, six. Raise those abs. Eight, nine, ten. Five reps to go, come on, keep squeezing. Three, two, one, hold, okay, jump time, are you ready? Three, two, one, go. One, two, three, four, five, knees out, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, come on, ten more, nine, eight, Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice job. Okay, we're done with the band now. Now we're going to go into some exercises that you may need some uh, weights for. So the first one is going to be a sumo deadlift. You want the heaviest object you can, either two medium or heavy dumbbells or a kettlebell. Then we're going to do some curtsy lunges which you can do either without weights or with two medium or light dumbbells, one in each hand at your sides. Okay. <clears throat> All right, so I'm gonna be using a kettlebell for my deadlift. So we're gonna have your feet super wide, wider than shoulder width, toes are gonna be pointed out. 
the kettlebell or the weight or whatever object you're using for your heavy weight is going to be level with your heel. So you're going to be over the object. Okay, so you're going to squat down. You can lean forward slightly, pull up on your weight, bring the hips down, chest forward, shoulders back, and lift. Light touch down on the ground or close to the ground. And you're going to squeeze your glutes all the way up. Keep your weight planted in your heels. 10 more reps. Squeeze those glutes. Nine. Eight. Keep going. Six. Five. Booty out. Four. Chest forward. Squeeze the glutes. And squeeze. Awesome. Okay, so for the curtsy lunge, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do mine without weight for the first set. Starting with my feet, hip width apart. By that I mean straight line from hip down to knee, from hip to knee to ankle. So for the curtsy lunges, I'm gonna start with my feet hip width apart, and I mean straight line from hip joint to knee joint down to the ankle joint. Okay, so the working leg is gonna go back behind the grounded foot, right behind, and the knee is gonna come down right behind that heel. Bring it back to hip width. We're gonna work the same side for 15 reps. Three. Get more muscle endurance that way. 10 more. 10. Nice and controlled. Nine. Eight. Good job. Chest up. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three, two, one more. Okay, back to the center, other side, straight into it. One, the back knee almost touches the floor. Two, three, four, five. Back from 10 now, keep going. 10, steady, nine, eight, seven, nearly there. Nice and controlled. Five more. Five. Abs tight. Four. Three. Two. One more. You can do it. And up. Okay, rest for 30 seconds. I'm going to go back to the sumo deadlift. Get ready. Level with your heels. Feet wide. Toes out. Deep breath. So when you reach down, you're gonna bring the hips down low, keeping the chest forwards. Ready? Here we go. Grab your weight, squeeze the glutes all the way up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, five more reps, five, four, three, two, one, squeeze, good job. Okay, so for the curtsy lunges, maybe you wanna add some weight to make it a bit more challenging, so we'll do a dumbbell in each hand. Okay. Work at your level, there's always plenty of time to gradually improve over the weeks. Shoulders back, chest up. Ready, we're gonna bring the working leg behind the grounded foot, push through the heel to come up to the center. 15, all on the same side, building muscle endurance, focusing one side at a time. You're doing a great job today. 10 more, 10, nine, Eight, seven, awesome, six, five, four, three, two, one more, awesome. Okay, other side, ready? Let's go. Back knee behind the front, one, two, three, Four, 
Woo, seven, five, everybody, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, five more, come on, stay with it, five, four, three, two, one more, awesome, good job, okay, rest it up, we got one more set left, 30 seconds rest, grab a towel, grab a drink, have this little stretch in between, a little quad stretch, all right, so we're going to go back into your sumo deadlifts, 15 reps, let's get into position, level with your heels okay so from the side booty out chest forward ready lift squeeze the glutes one squeeze at the top two three nice four five ten more ten nine keep that chest forward eight Seven, six, squeeze, squeeze again, three more, keep going, weight in your heels, hips down, chest forwards all the time, and squeeze, awesome, all right, here we go, big finish, curtsy lunge, okay, Hip width, straight line, hip joint, and knee joint, ankle joint. Step behind the ground of the leg. You ready? Keep the chest up, up tight, and go. 15, one, two, a little bit of a sweat going on here. Three, I hope you are as well. Four, five, looking good. Six, seven, eight, Nine, feel the burn a little bit. Five more, come on, keep that posture good. Five, four, three, two, one more. Nice, now the other side, ready? Straight into it. Down we go, back behind the grounded foot. Two, three, four, Five, back from 10. Come on, finish strong. 10, nine, eight. Back knee down, close to the floor. Four left, come on. Four, three, two. One more for luck. And finish. Awesome job, you made it. We made it together. All right, I hope you enjoyed this workout. I hope you got your heart rate up and a bit of a burn in the legs. Next time we work a little bit harder. Thank you for watching. I really enjoyed working with you. I highly recommend that you finish up with a full body stretch. I have a recommendation which will appear right here. Thank you so much for watching. Look forward to seeing the next video. Be sure to like and subscribe comment in the comment section below how you enjoyed the workout. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye.